Well, welcome everyone. Uh, this is a different video, obviously. Uh, I'm doing something other than just video games. Uh, I felt like since it's August 19th and I finally got my uh, Note 7 in mail, I figured why not just do a an overview. This is not a review, it's just an overview. I just got it. I just want to show you with my uh, 4K camera just how it looks, how it feels, and that kind of stuff. One unique feature that I like about this phone, it's all made out of glass, Gorilla 5 glass. I don't know if you guys can see it. I'm going to do my best to show you this, but it's all Gorilla 5 glass. I mean, you can see it right here. I'm holding it. I don't know if you guys can see the edges of it. You can see the reflection. It's all Gorilla 5 glass. Very unique. And it feels pretty hefty. It feels pretty hefty too. So let me show you a pen. This is the pen that came with it. And this time around, this pen, it's also made out of the glass too. So with this pen, you can basically, uh, you can drop it into water and nothing's going to happen. I'm just trying to focus my camera on this so you guys can see it better and clearer. There it is. The version that I have is the, uh, it looks gold, but it's not gold. It's actually sky blue, dark gray sky blue. I mean, let me show you right here. Here, you guys can see it. Uh, there it is. So anyway, let's just go through some features right here really quick. Let me show you the back. I think I already did. I want to show you the back of the phone. You can see it's all glass. It's uh, 5.7 inches diagonal. Uh, it uses the uh, micro C. Uh, I think that's what's called. I think uh, it's a C micro C something charger. Obviously, I'm not, an, I'm not an expert on this phone. I'm just doing an overview, so I'm probably butchering it. But I figured, why not share this really quick with you guys? Uh, now you can see it right there. I'm trying to focus right there. You can see the the micro C. It's a different than the one on the uh, S7 and S7 Edge. There's a speakers right there, and that is the hole where you plug in your uh, pen. And right here, you can see it's all made out of Gorilla 5 glass. There, same thing here. Another cool feature that comes with this phone is this uh, camera, this facing iris camera. I haven't used it honestly because uh, I'm not a huge fan of scanning my eyes and all that. What if something goes wrong? I cannot unlock my phone. What I'm have to do is change new set of eyes. <laughs> anyway, let me lay it down a bit. <clears throat> let me show you a little bit around the edges like this. I just want to. I know I'm butchering this. This is not the best video, but I I'm trying to give you guys the best uh, possible viewing angle that I can. All right, since we got all that, let me uh, go ahead and show you a little bit on uh, how the phone looks. Let me turn off the, uh, the light really quick. So just uh, bear with me a little bit. Let me turn off the light. There it is. So I'm going to do this without a light now, so it's going to be all blue, bluish blue. Here. There's the pen. You can use the pen. It's kind of cool. You can go switch to different apps. I don't have any that many apps installed right now because uh, there. You can get the Uber. This is all the apps that I actually transferred that I have, which is kind of cool. What Samsung has done on this uh, Galaxy series is they make it so easier for you to transfer from your previous phone to this phone. Whatever files you have, you can transfer it, you know, which is cool. The pen is very nice. It's very uh, sturdy. Here, I'll go to uh, YouTube Music really quick right here. see where your music take you and all that 
I have to sign in. So I'm not going to do that right now. I'm going to exit that. Uh, let me show you uh, some other features as well. And there's a the camera right here. I know that it has HDR. I haven't tried it. I haven't uh, done that yet. Because I just got this phone. I haven't even started it. But uh, let me see if I can maybe... Let me go over here to uh, to YouTube. Maybe I can uh, click on one of my videos and check it out. I will click on it. And this pen is very cool. What is this? A new version of YouTube is available. I'll install it now from Google Play. Ah, okay. We'll do that later. I don't want to do that now. I just want to show you some of the videos, just how, how it is. Uh, this is a Joe Rogan. This is what I was watching. No, I'm not going to play his videos because I don't want to flag. You know, it's a you know, copyright thing. So this is my channel right here, Eden's Gaming World. So I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, I'm going to click on some of those uh, 4K videos. Hold on a second. Uh, I'll just go on my video. I don't want to get flagged again, you know. I'm trying to avoid being flagged. So uh, let's click on why there's no man's sky uh, on Xbox One. So let's click on that video really quick and let's just see how the quality is, how it looks. Let me just show you. Hey, this. what's up, guys? Hey. Let me show you the size. Just look how big this screen is, man. It's like ridiculous. Hold on. Just look at the size of this screen. It's just just retardedly uh, uh, huge. Look at that. I think if if they make phones any bigger than six inches, or if they go seven and a half. That's going to be a tablet. You can't even call that phone because this is more than enough for you to see, honestly. If you cannot see from this distance, uh, then you definitely will need a, uh, I don't know. But look at the size. I mean, look at my hands, and I have a pretty big hand, and this is still huge. Uh, that's what she said. You guys have to kind of experience this yourself. Let me pause this. Hold on. Let me pause this. Uh, video uh, you guys have to see this for yourself just to kind of get a sense of how huge and big uh, this phone is and it feels very hefty compared to my S7 Edge this one feels a bit heftier more sturdier and uh, again she says more thicker <laughs> but all in all guys uh, this is just my first overview I will do an additional review on this phone. I just want to do a quick overview of this uh, S7 Edge and just show it to you a little bit. I know it's a ghetto video, and I'm even though I'm filming it in 4K, it's, it's still kind of shaky and ghetto. I wish I had a tripod to put this on. But hey, hopefully, you guys, you will appreciate this video for what it's worth and uh, this cool pen that comes with it, man. I will do some more reviews on this phone. This is a 64 gigabyte version, obviously. I think that's all they have at 64. And uh, I'll explore some more features. I'll do a uh, review on second generation Note 7 Gear VR. Uh, I was looking to buy one. I couldn't find it anywhere. Uh, I might have to go to AT&T store and see if they have it. And plug it in and do a uh, review on that as well and show it to you guys. But all in all... <laughs> Uh, so far, I'm liking this phone. It, it's it's uh, really nice. But look, if you guys are on the fence between S7 Edge and Note 7, they're both equally good. I have S7 Edge, and I love it, man. It's a beautiful phone. Uh, both of them, they're using the same processor. The, uh, the difference between the Note 7 and S7 Edge is the size of a screen, and you get the pen. It's more sturdier. Uh, but they both take the same advantage of uh, processor, you know. Either way, uh, you cannot go wrong with either of these two phones. But I would highly recommend you get a Note 7. If you have to choose, go with a Note 7. It's a bigger phone, Gorilla 5 glass, more sturdier, has a built-in HDR on, so you can watch these Netflix movies on HDR. So, uh, But anyway, this is just an overview. I don't want to... I want to make that clear to everybody. I'm not reviewing this phone. This is just an order.